brother had to do a lot of time. You did nine what years. Do you think? No, no, no. I, I, let me tell you. So when I when he read about it in the paper, he had a stroke. Wow. And it paralyzed the whole left side of his body. Yeah, we on boss talk one on one. One on one. Yeah, we gonna talk. Four years, like four years. Five, I had my daughter. She was four when he died. So like four years after. After so, he got out. So when he wow. did the 15 years, how long were you, were you locked up at that time? I had never got locked up. That's what I'm saying. He took he the charge. Took the he took the whole home. charge. But watch this. I get secret indicted the very next year by the feds. Wow. They were after you from the get-go. Just that, that, that just, my daddy had told me that. It's like, oh, you're going if mm -hmm. you don't stop what you're doing. And I lied to him. I was like, I promise I'm going to stop. Because Cause even know. after all of that and how you felt when he went and how many years he got knowing that he was a preacher, you still didn't stop. I stopped for like 30 days because he asked yeah. me to. And I was like, so I tried. So why did you go back? Because that's all I wanted to so do. That's all she knew. And, and, and I say all I knew, I, I th I've always had a hustle mentality. That's right. But And and I, and I always wanted to make some money. It was not It was basically all I knew, but that's what I wanted to do. You right. know what I'm saying? So then now here I am, then got caught up by the feds, and I'm stuck like my name. And, your and I'm daddy, stuck like Chuck. Your mm -hmm. daddy did nine years, and you... For the, how long were you out while he was in before you was eight? Not even a year. So you wasn't even out a year, but that had to be a tough year. Just being and what they, it was, and then the thing I would still go like I leave Quahers on Saturdays. I'm driving to the prison Straight to him to go see my dad to go see my dad because I was his, you know, he I was a daddy's you. girl. And was, so, was your mama mad at you? Yeah, she of was, course. She was mad at me and him. Yeah, because if she divorced him. I can imagine how she, she felt about you the whole time. Mm -hmm. And how did that? How did that make you feel? Well, she still like even though she was mad at me, she never like she would still keep my kids. Oh, or, she didn't she, like, treat I don't want you, you terrible. To. No, she. I mean, she had like an attitude or whatever. But it. she like, oh, yo, Chuck, you gonna go to you know? She always saying you going to you gonna end up dead or in jail. She that she always said. And I said, stop speaking that on my life. She like, but that's what's gonna happen because that's how you living. So you just gotta take it for what it's worth unless you change your life. Mm -hmm. And so she never got to see me change because she died while I was in prison. Wow, at and, the age of forty-two. So mm -hmm. when you young, yeah. But th let me go back. I wanna, I wanna go back to your dad being locked up all those years. Um, you go to prison yourself while he's well. You get locked up and go to prison while he's locked up. Who got who gets out first? You get out first, right? No, he did. He got out first. Mm -hmm. So how, you had to do a lot of time. You did nine well, years. Think, no, no, no. I, I, let me tell you. So when I when he read about it in the paper, he had a stroke. Wow. And it paralyzed the whole left side of his body. Wow. And then he But he knew you was going to get caught up because he But he just was hurt. Right. You know so it, 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 he knew it cuz I mean he knew it. He knew it cuz he, he just it was to but you. he never but I'm still mine I'm still going to visit him put money I'm doing everything I'm I'm thinking it's that's necessary. Right. But then when he when he read it once he got in the hospital he wrote the federal judge and he said whatever time you're going to give her just add it to the time that I already have. Because I don't want my daughter going to prison. Wow! And what did what? But did, that didn't, that didn't work. The judge, when I went before the judge, read he the, told you. The that. judge told me. He said, "You're a minister to society. You going?" He said, "You going? You are." So he going. probably knew that you was the reason your dad was even in there. Of course he did. Wow. And, yeah, it's crazy. And and so, your dad's in prison. You're in prison. You're writing him. He's writing you. Mm -hmm. Y'all writing each other back and forth all the time. Mm -hmm. You just tell him you love him and tell no, him. No, he was just sending me positive stuff. He was like, "Yo, don't give up." No, he didn't say yo, but he be like, "Listen, don't give up. Nothing beats a failure, but a try. At least you didn't get the life sentence that they offered you. You, you know, you got an opportunity to get out and make it right. Yeah. Like you got so much talent. Do whatever it is. Do make money with your talent. If you know how to flip the drugs, you can flip other stuff. Mm -hmm. So you're gonna uh, or you're going to lose your life." Yeah, we on Boss Talk 101. 101. Yeah, we gon' talk.